Hello everyone. Today I am going to discuss the topic technical textiles, which is a subject of uh, M Tech second semester. So first of all, introduction. The first image that comes in mind about textiles is apparel, but clothing is just one, not the only purpose of textiles. Textiles come to our help in every walk of life and textiles used for other purpose rather than apparel comes under the category of technical textiles. Textiles can be used as simple doormat to sophisticated clothes for missile head fabrication. They form an important part of the automobile interior in the same fashion as they are used for high tech applications like reinforcing a dam or the body of the vehicle. Definition is technical textiles are specially designed and engineered structures that are used for their technical performance, not for aesthetics or decorative characteristics. The term technical textiles is widely used term for non-traditional textiles. Now the difference between technical textiles and non-technical textiles. Uh, the main differences are in application areas, constitute material, performance, what is exactly required in the product, functional properties required which are very specific for technical textiles, then difference in manufacturing method and equipment used. Application area of technical textiles. There are mainly 12 different areas of application for technical textiles. These are agrotech related with agriculture, horticulture and forestry, build tech, building and construction, cloth tech related with technical components of footwear and clothing, geotech, geotextiles and civil engineering. Then Home tech related with uh, technical components of furniture, household textiles, and floor coverings. In tech, filtration, conveying, cleaning, and other industrial pur purposes. Med tech related with medical and hygiene. Mobile tech, automobiles, shipping, railways, and aerospace. Oiko tech related with environment protection. Then pack tech for packing. Pro-tech related with personal and property protection, sport tech, sports and laser. Now fibers commonly used for production of technical textiles. Uh, these may be classified in two categories, uh, commodity fibers and high technology or specialty fibers. Specialty fibers are required for high temperature protection, high impact, and dynamic energy absorption capacity, high cut through resistance, ballistic body armor for high risk jobs and sports. Community fibers can further classified in two categories, conventional fibers, cotton, viscose, jute and silk, high tensile fibers, polyester, polyethylene, polyolefins. High technology or specialty fibers. Uh, these are aramid, carbon, glass, polypropylene, PVA, PBI, leucel, spandex, etc. Now properties and application of common and specialty fibers. First of all, cotton, uh, good performance and durability is its uh, basic property. Also, it is uh, having good abrasion resistance. Application areas of cotton, almost all home tech applications like uh, tablecloth, terry towel, bed sheet, shower curtains, chair beds, etc. Mat tech uh, in medical textiles, absorbent pad, bandages, gauzes, then mobile tech, seat covers, carpet, bags are made of cotton. Then uh, Viscose, 
viscose can be equally used for various applications same as cotton besides it is also used as artificial kidney and artificial liver next is jute is used in uh, protec means protective textile jute is used in uh, protec applications mainly because of following properties high strength high abrasion then durability and washability and relatively low cost it is also used in automobile textiles uh, jute has its application in geotextile also next is polyester uh, polyester has its application in mobile tech where seat covers headliner tires safety belts door panels package trays safety devices these are made of polyester then home tech almost all home applications then mat tech orthopedic bandages hard wall uh, it has its application in protec also frame retardant fabric because nowadays we use fr polyester for this purpose and some application in geotextile also next is nylon uh, it has use application in mobile tech tires carpet airbags v belt these are made of nylon then home tech carpets then mat tech specially wound contact layer is made of nylon protec and geotextiles nylon is used for the following purpose uh, because uh, it is it has bright colors abrasion resistance is good then flame retardant finish is effective for nylon now there is a table uh, which is showing important properties of specialty fibers uh, fibers are meta ramids para ramids carbon glass polypropylene spandex pvi tensel and the basic properties tenacity breaking extension initial modulus specific gravity melting temperature so we should know the basic properties of these specialty fibers like uh, meta ramids it has good melting temperature and the breaking extension is good and these are specially used in uh, protec specially for fire protection purpose then para ramids it has uh, good initial modulus uh, good tenacity so uh, and good melting temperature also so it is mainly used for uh, body armor specially uh, bulletproof jackets etc so like uh, this uh, all fibers have their uh, special properties and accordingly they can be used for particular end uses and uses of some specialty fibers uh, like meta ramids uh, filter bags and industrial protective clothing racing driver suit cargo covers uh, para ramids mainly body armor tire coats radiator hose um, high speed board components carbon uh, aircraft and space shuttle automotives there are many applications in automotive then medical implants glass is also used in aircraft and aerospace consumer goods roofing tiles etc polypropylene sail cloth marine ropes and cables protective clothing spandex sports and laser pvi racing driver suit tensile filtration media for oil industry inorganic fiber military applications so uh, then uh, fluorine containing fiber filtration media for uh, corrosive material so each uh, specialty fiber has its specific uh, specific purpose and application now if we see the contribution of uh, 
different fibers the major portion or major contribution is uh, the man made fiber which is 85% of total consumption in the field of technical textiles 10% contribution is uh, cotton 3% jute and 2% others and finally if we see methods of preparing technical textiles the large proportion in technical textiles is uh, non woven which is 50 to 60 percent then uh, woven it is uh, 40 to 50 percent it is not 60 percent it is 40 to 50 percent then others 10 percent in uh, woven uh, fabric mainly filament yarns are used which is uh, having proportion of 60 to 70 percent and spun yarn 30 to 40 percent spun yarn is uh, further classified uh, in three categories and mainly uh, main contribution is uh, friction spinning 85 percent of spun yarn is made on friction spinning machine ring spinning 10 percent and others only 5 percent so this is all about uh, introduction to technical textiles Thank you very much.